during this eclipse on April 8th, uh, I'm going to be performing the modern Eddington experiment, which is an experiment that measures the tiny deflection of light, bending of light, as it passes the sun on its way into our camera. The moon moves around the earth, and the earth, as it moves around the sun, at some point, the moon becomes exactly between the sun and the earth, and you can see a shadow right there. That shadow moves from west to east across the American continent. In 1917, Einstein published his first paper predicting an extra amount of bending of light as light passes the sun and put out a call to astronomers to measure this. This has been done over the period of a hundred years many times. In 1919, Eddington's experiment proved Einstein's theory because the deflections of the stars were twice as large as expected by Newton, Newton's theory, Sir Isaac Newton. Einstein. The point now of a continuing to perform this experiment in, on April 8th is because we can do it infinitely better. We can get way, way more data we can get data close to the surface of the sun where the bending is the maximum. 